Oh, don't touch the clowns. And don't let the clowns touch you. Just off Highway 95 in the state of Nevada, there lies the small town of Tonopa. For miles around, it's, it's desolate, and in the silence there lies one lonely motel. Across from the motel is an old cemetery where miners were buried, and it's not the ghost within the cemetery that will make you run in fear. For those of you faint of heart and fearful of clowns, <laughs> clowns, uh, this is not a delicate story. America's scariest motel is haunted in, haunted by hundreds of clowns. <laughs> Spending the night in this creepy motel is definitely a true test of courage because it's full of clowns. All the clowns tacks onto the doors, shelves of clown dolls staring at you with their beady glass eyes, and collectibles in the lobby that are neatly seated in chairs as if guarding the place from harmful intruders. There are clown paintings on the walls that look at you, and if you have a second floor room you can look out from the balcony and see why the motel is so eerily quiet and dark at night. It's the cemetery. The Clown Motel stands right next to Tonopa's old, dusty, unlit cemetery. Closed for over 100 years, it's packed with the graves of the town's miners who died very unpleasantly. That should be cause for panic, and even more so if you've ever watched the movie Poltergeist, and you decide to spend the night at this unique lodge. Spend at least a minute or two wondering if just maybe part of a cemetery full of graves of men who died horrible deaths once stretched underneath land now occupied by the Clown Motel. <laughs> well, I, I tell this story with locked doors and windows. Well, I was one of the lucky ones. Oh, they are coming. They're coming for me. As the saying goes, you can check out any time you want, but you can't leave. There's a lot more buried there than you might think.